Skyrocketing gas prices are impacting the lives of Santa Clarita drivers, and one resident, Troy Dunlap, tells us how it's affecting his life. It's, uh, it's a burden on a lot of people, um, especially people that don't have a lot of income. Fortunately for me, I have gas paid for, but for my daughters, it's, gonna make, it's definitely going to have a burden on them. According to AAA, California gas prices have increased $2.58 higher than the national average. California Governor Gavin Newsom called for a special legislative session this past Friday in which he exclaims oil companies are fleecing Californians. Yeah, they're taking advantage of you, every single one of you, every single day. Hundreds of millions of dollars a week they're putting in their pockets, lining their pockets at your expense, and then polluting this planet and leaving us all the external reality and costs associated with that. Newsom opted to send $9.5 billion in rebates to taxpayers to offset the high prices at the pump. But would this be enough for local residents? Conserve Fuel employee Gabriela de Recio Soco tells us her views on the matter. We are paying more money now, so it's not enough as a regular people, poor people here in California, that we don't make no more than 40000 a year. So we um, have to have um, two jobs. I, I, I get my, my gas here, so now I am paying the double than before. I used to pay $30 a week, so now I am paying $60 the double, so the money is not enough. Yeah. For Kenyans News, I'm Stuart Carpell.